Okay. Can the Spanish get chariots? I don't think so. Don't mind me. <laughs> I could just randomly take brigade if I wanted to piss off the Pontix. Depends on who owns this place. Might be the Thracians. Uh, actually, Rebels still. It says that. We haven't seen it in a while, though. True. Alright, so... Alright, desert, desert town in the middle of nowhere. Let's fly and go! <laughs> Fuck it. Victory and glory. Well, that still didn't work. <laughs> oh, look at that beautiful blue. Beautiful blue blob of Africa. All of it except for Numidia and the Nile is mine. Soon the dots will be connected. All over the place! Moves depleted, sir. Your honor. Send him off to the Brighton town. Nice! I took a chance and that got him a trade interest. He's now sneaky. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Okay, they moved most of their army out of out of here. That's what happened. General, you want to die? Fuck him up. Hey, look, some barbarian cavalry. What's wedge? Uh, it's a formation that does really, really deadly on charge. But it uh, uh, more of your more of your cavalry also forward. die on charge. Ah. It's only meant to be used on really really. It's what a wedge does is basically. You see that giant infantry wall over there? You're gonna bust a hole through it. We're gonna sneak through it so we can get flanking. That's the point of a wedge. If you have a giant enemy wall that you just can't get through, then you just wedge it. And that will force a hole. A lot, your cavalry unit's likely dead, but you'll be able to punch some units through there. It also compl like if you do two cavalry units and wedge, like a like a single infantry unit, they're probably dead. But I don't. I hate losing like a lot of my cavalry on charge. So, all right. So this full army is gonna go take a uh, Semo Rebreva. However the fuck you say that. Imperator. And we're gonna attack the Germans. Oh my god, so much is going on at once. How much is Capua making now that we have that city? 164? Nice, even Lily Bayum is almost out of debt. Carthage is barely out of debt. Yeah. Remember when we were making like... Almost 2,000 gold a turn? Yeah. From Carthage. <laughs> I those do, were, those I were do. nice. I do remember that. Those oh, were nice like, days. Carthage has so much of the debt now, and it's going to have even more of the debt after Imperial Palace is complete. <laughs> Which will take six fucking turns. <laughs> okay, so all of my money is pretty much spent. So Lugdunum and Alicia aren't going to be building anything this turn. Okay, so let's uh, get... Save two. Attack. He's a good commander and a good attacker. Let's go. If we win this, we can go blockade uh, Trier and have uh, and have yet another city. You know me. I am a true Roman of the old style. I believe in discipline, 
dignity and duty. I believe that Rome has a destiny to rule the world. I also believe that we have a destiny. A destiny that starts afresh here. Today we go into battle against the German horde. They are indeed mighty men and brave foes. They have been whipped to the battlefield like cattle for slaughter. Our numbers here are about equal. Therefore, a victory here will be hard fought, but glorious. Uh, but sir, doesn't banging our sword against the shield uh, dull the blade a little bit? We must be alert and you know, these maybe. We have more horsemen but than hey, we're too hyped for this shit, so fuck it. Many. We must be careful of them. There is no shame in fear. There is only shame in letting fear rule you. Try not to look scared, and you'll find bravery in your heart! He actually uh, has an altered speech. The first. Await my orders! Uh, his first little speech there was, uh. was related to his true Roman stature there. Oh, you fucking douchebags. Oh, they have warhounds. Alright, so this... Oh, yes. this is gonna take a while to even fucking get here. You only have three sphere warbands? Prepare to die. Granted, a fuck ton of dogs running at you. It's a ter terrifying sight. <laughs> oh shit! One of the women flew like 20 feet. Sappers, which were both the screeching women and warhounds. They both do that. So my cavalry is a bit in shambles, but. They seem worse. Yeah. There was, I, I don't know how a while this was ago, or with exactly which country in Asia, but it was somewhere in East Asia. There was a police riot. I think I think it was South Korea, and the police only had shields, but they were using Roman tactics to like quell the the riot. And the rioters couldn't really do anything. <laughs> I mean, I can imagine. 
because they because the um, yeah I figured they were the doing police this. were like consist were could were consistently like rotating their men out into the front line and just like slowly pushing the rioters back. The enemy general flees. Press forward so the spirit of his army is broken too. Gods be praised! The enemy general is dead! His men know their doom approaches! Yeah, I would say go and finish attacking those, because they had their spears up. Get out of there! Get out of there! Whew. Whew, that was a close one. I don't even know how I ran into them. Okay, they're running away. Enemies show their true virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits Ooh. running from our men. Jesus, that did not go well. For my cavalry. Yeah. My general my general will slowly recover units, but that that just kinda sucked. Ugh. right here. I don't know how my general's units keep dying. Like, why did a random general unit just die right here? This is a heroic victory worthy of Roman arms! I'm glad my general himself didn't die. That was a close one. Yeah. You know, most of that was cavalry for sure. Let's uh, let's do a little bit of patching up. Oh, it looks he like... lost. A, he lost another guy. He's down to three. Huh? But oh. he had four when the round ended. No, no, no. They all. It's always one less. But when he goes on the battlefield, he himself counts as a number. It oh. does. It just doesn't show here. Yeah. Uh... yeah. We're gonna combine those. And combine those. Okay, so not a significant force anymore, but enough to take. Engage the enemy. Try it. Besieging yeah. settlement, sir. Settlement under siege, sir. I would keep an eye out for that Britain army right there, though. No more moves, sir. What's in that Britain army? Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> That's just a raiding party. Orders? Yeah, we're fine. Imperator. No, we don't. <laughs> Parthia, we go. Moves depleted, sir. Yeah. Archimedes. They're the only ones left that I need. Yeah. Otherwise, I have everyone else's map information. So yeah, you're seeing most of the game right here. 
most of what you have to take. How many, okay, so let's, we control 20 regions now. 72 battles won, seven battles lost. I think, I think five, I think I've lost two battles legitimately, if I remember right. Oh no. Whoa, the, the people are starting to hate the Julii, I wonder why. Because they're not able to do shit. Ah, shit. Yeah, I won't be able to blockade Asuka this turn. Oh well. I <sighs> well, this was quite the recording session, but I, I think I'll have to end it here. I have a fucking, I fucking hell, I'm tired. That was a lot of thinking, a lot of good battles, actually. <laughs> but, and, uh... But I think overall, we're doing pretty well. We're mm -hmm. finally kicking the Britons' ass promptly. And, uh... Kappa's, Kappa's making money again, and Lily Bayum is almost making money again. We've definitely made progress. And... In the next go, we will find out who is really controlling Byzantium. And we will take Trier. We will start to take the German... The German bastards. Who have... Been a thorn in my side for too long now. <laughs> and not to mention that they're doing really well. Like, this is, this is one of the best I've ever seen the Germans. Oh, I think Scythia controls. Maybe. That's we'll awesome. see soon enough. We will. Whew, that was a long recording session. Anyway, we'll be back next time.